everybody along with Ray Ferraro down at ice level. My name is James Sabalski. Ray, an opportunity to take a real stranglehold on this one here tonight. Another win would really put them in a good spot. Driver's seat for sure. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Back to the blue line. Hammers a shot, and the traffic neutralizes that threat. Baltimore's got the puck against the boards. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Moves it around along the half wall. The Bulldogs play it along the wing. Centering pass! Moves it up. Nearing the point. Puts it up front! Blistering shot! Can't get it to go. Takes the feet at the back end. Jabs the puck away. Here's an offensive chance. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Sends the pass over. Morose looks around. Halifax gains a hold of it. Into the offensive zone. Baltimore's got the puck along the boards. Crescenzi's swooping in on the attack. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Moves the puck. On the attack along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. Puck picked up by Brown. The Stampeders are on the attack. Sends it over. This one gives them nothing in front. Loose puck battle along the boards. The Bulldogs will play it in their own end. Grabbed along the board by White. White's got the puck. White's going to play it against the half wall. Halifax has it near the wall. Knocked away. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Just wide. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. From point blank range. Oh, and he completely blew it on that miss. Yep. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. Takes it across the blue line. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. We got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. Tripped him up, and he's off to the box for it, Ray. Reaching out for the puck, you get your stick into his feet. This is the consequence. Well, as both teams dig in for the face-off here just moments away, it's our first opportunity to look at the power play unit here. Easiest thing in the world, James. Tell somebody else to relax. The power play hasn't scored yet. They're not relaxed, and it's not easy to do, but that's the key to success. Bank pass off the boards. And now he tries to get it across to Moore. Too much traffic in the lane. Takes the feed at the point. The Stampeders have possession shorthanded and manages to clear the zone. Baltimore's got a hold of it against the wall. Broken up at center. Halifax has the puck. Gets it out of his own end. Looking to break out here on the power play. Through center along the wing. Puts it on goal. Great glove save. Buck is dropped and we are back underway. And manages to clear the zone. The Bulldogs have it against the wall. And a great job by the shorthanded unit those last few moments as the penalty expires. 
Well, the penalty killers can go back to the bench knowing they did their job. Score remains the same as it was when that penalty was taken. That's intercepted. Horvat's got it into offensive territory. Horvat's got it along the wing. In close! That's turned aside from the blocker. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. Handles the puck. Quick pass to Reinhardt. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Oh, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well. On... Trying to gain a step. He's in all alone. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Here's a short pass to Horvat. Here's a blast. Scores! Oh, that's a good shot, James. Right off the bar and in. The shooter's going to love looking at this one on the video. I'd like to tell you he was aiming it there, but he shoots the puck quickly and hits the bottom of the crossbar and bounces in. has dictated play here in the first, which is why they lead. Dominated in shots, dominated in territorial play, and now with the one-goal lead, they'll stretch it out if they can, going into the intermission. Tries to get it over to Reinhardt. Reinhardt's got it in the offensive zone. And that one's broken up. Here they come on the attack. Takes the pass from the boards. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Here's a chance right in the slot. Quick feed to Pominville. Pominville's picking up steam. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. Sends the pass down low. Here's a chance on the backhand. That's close, James. The goaltender ends up beating the shooter to the post. As that's a, that looks like it's a goal, but it's shut down. The good old-fashioned hook is sending him off to the box. He's almost in the right position, but he's got to give him a little hook. When he gives that tug, he goes to the penalty box and gets called every time. They'll go back to work on their special teams. Down one, a chance to tie on the power play. What a great chance for them here. But you can't stress. You have to be confident and aggressive, but don't force anything. Gets it out of his own end. Slides away from his crease now to play the puck. And the always popular icing call made, and you know what that means, Ray. Now, offensive zone faceoff, man, he missed the play going down the ice, and that's a gimme icing. Now they can't change. We've got tired guys on the ice. Here in the later stages of this period, we got a one nothing game to this point. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Puts it on net. That one's off the blocker. Here's a clearing attempt from their own end. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. Puck lands right back onto the blade. With possession along the wall. Takes the puck at the point. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. With authority. Baltimore has gained possession along the boards. And the PK unit gets their man out of the box. You work so hard to get yourself back in the game. You earn a power play, and then you fail to cash in. So they still trail by one. The game will continue at even strength. Oh, what a beautiful glove save! He clearly thought he had room to get by, but it got closed off in a hurry. He took a big hit there. Halifax has capitalized on their scoring opportunities and lead as a result here late in the first. as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Taken along the wall by Pominville. Stopped by the goaltender. Baltimore has got a hold of it along the wall. Over the line they come. Puts the puck on net. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. The Stampeders have controlled this game here in the first period. More shots, more goals. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. 
Sends a pass over. The first frame is complete as the horn sounds, ending the first 20 minutes of play. Well, a fun start at both ends of the rink. 1-0 is a score through the first frame. As both teams get a breather here in this first intermission, we'll do the same and get ready for period number two. Second period set to get underway. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Baltimore's not going to want to change much in that first period. Just the score. They had the puck a lot, but they trail by one. Here's a chance. Nothing. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Right out in front, and a stick in the lane ends that threat. Makes the save. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. Halifax has found a way to get a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead in the second. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Move to the middle, and that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Carries it across the line. Into the corner now. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Delayed penalty coming up here. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. McCarran's off to the box, holding the call. He's not going to like the call, but he's got a fistful of sweater. And you're going to have to pay for it. You can't take it home with you. Big opportunity here for them. They'll have plenty of time to work this five on three. Well, good news for them as they trail by one, they get a power play. The key here, though, James, is to be confident without pressing. Just get the puck to the net. Make the penalty killer stress. Moved out in front. Off the post. Baltimore's luck continues to be bad. A shot off the post, and they still trail. Moves right to the middle. Oh, what a missed chance that was. Yeah, he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything right. Now you just got to get the puck on the tape. Baltimore's got the puck along the wall. Along the half wall with the puck. Still keeps a hold of it. Good hit on the play. Comes up on the blocker save. Back at the point, they set it up. Nice pass. Takes the feed. Back to the point it goes. 
And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Special teams coming up huge on that goal. They take advantage of having the extra man by moving the puck quickly. That's a beautiful goal. The penalty killers just ran out of gas here. They're under incredible pressure from the power play. Eventually, it's a power play goal as they capitalize on the extra man. The Bulldogs are on the board. They have tied things up here in the second. They've worked hard to get this game back to level. Both teams back to even strength. Impressive job by the penalty killers on that play. Really good pressure by the penalty killers there to keep this game tied. They tie up the power play in pretty nice fashion there. There's another stop. And he slides it quickly to Brown. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Right to the middle. He scores! They take the lead. Well, it looked like this game was going to be even for the longest time because nobody seemed to have the upper hand. He's probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. Halifax has found a way to break the deadlock here with a goal in the second. They'd love to get another one. Really take control of this if they can in the middle period. While the setters are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Slides the puck over. From the point, they take control of it. Rep trying to shake the defender. All alone. No, broken up from behind. Scoops up the puck now. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Receives the pass. Moves it quickly over to Brown. Schlemko stick handling in his own zone. Takes the pass. Moves it around along the half wall. Unloads it! No room for that one to get through. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. On the attack along the boards. Quick snap! Beat the goaltender, but couldn't beat the post! Brown's got to know right before he takes this hit that he's going to get run over. More than half the period left to play. Halifax leads by one. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Moves it to Pominville. Here's a shot. Gets in front of it. Oh, he's trying to box him out. This is getting a little testy. Just because one guy wants to fight, you don't have to. He says no way. Halifax has looked good offensively tonight, putting a lot of pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Baltimore's got the puck along the boards. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Takes a shot. Big time stop there. Halifax gets the puck near the boards. Pushes it across to Pominville. Right in the open ice. That one's picked off. Baltimore's done a great job without the puck. Nice pick off there. This game's close because of it. Moves the puck along the half wall. Into the corner of the attacking area. Slides it back to the blue line. Right up front. And that's picked off in front. Up along the wing. With possession along the wall. Shot. Blocker save. That is sweeping up the trash there. Good save. Off to the corner. Everybody can readjust. Halifax gains a hold of the puck against Whoa. the boards. Pominville's got it in the offensive end. Hangs onto the puck. Oh, and he misses an opportunity there. Looking to be too perfect. Get it on the net. You've got a better chance to squeak one through the goaltender than if you miss it outside the net. Halifax looks to move the puck from their own end. The Bulldogs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. 
Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Snaps one on net. Big time save with the blocker. He ran right through him on that hit. Lined him up. Timed it perfectly. Here in the late goings of the period, it's 2-1. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. And that's blocked. The Stampeders will play it from the defensive zone. Centering pass. Takes the feed. Here's a chance. Shuts him down. Halifax gains control of the puck. Along the half wall with the puck. Centering pass. Easily turned away by the glove. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Quick pass to Moore. Carries it in. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Centered out in front, and they can convert to the play, and makes the save. Morose plays it against the boards. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here comes the official's decision. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there. It sticks between the player's feet. Another special teams opportunity for both sides. The man advantage unit is back to work again. Well, this power play shows up at a rather opportune time. They're trailing by one, and now a chance to level the score off. Aggression will be the key for them. And that goes off a player in front. Puck picked up in the open ice. Moves it around along the half wall. Here's a short pass to Brown. Baltimore has got a hold of it against the wall. Forces the turnover and comes up with the puck. Fires it into the offensive corner. Sends the pass over. Takes it across the blue line. Second frame almost done. Well inside a minute now. The Stampeders get a hold of the puck. Whistle blown as a few players go ducking for cover on the bench. Getting into the later stages of this period, it's a 2-1 hockey game. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that's another power play marker. Oh, the power play coach is going to be pumped here. They have done some extra work on the power play over the last 10 days or so. Really paying off tonight. going east on a westbound street. That puck deflects off the defender and goes into the net. The Bulldogs have evened things up here late in this second period, and it looks like they've got a little jump in their legs now. Well, they've shortened the game out now. You go into the intermission, hopefully tied, and you've got to run at it in period three. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. And he makes the easy save. This one's still too close to call. 2-2 two -two is where we sit after 40 minutes. Please don't throw any objects on or towards the playing surface at any time during the game. The throwing of any object is grounds for immediate removal from this building. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. 
The next goal will be a critical one as we are still tied, getting underway here in the third. Handles the puck at the point. Just misses. He had plenty of time to step into this. He'd like to get this on the net because no matter how hard he shot it, it was up too high. Backhander. Stopped by the goaltender. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Pominville's got it across the line. Handles it along the blue line. Throws it on goal. Stopped by the goaltender. Into the offensive end now. Here's a chance right in front with the stop. Pollenville's taking it from his own end. Baltimore is trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Hookings the call. This is what they kind of call the lazy penalty these days, yeah, right? Yeah, it is, but, it, but really the problem is your feet and you panic and you're trying to help. And the more you help, the worse it gets. Go sit down. And he certainly dug himself a hole there. Face off and another opportunity to take a look at the man advantage unit here. Nothing more than average on this power play tonight, James. They get another one here. It would be nice for them to have some real positive minutes on the power play. Still plenty of time left in this frame. We are all tied up in this one. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Gets a piece of it with the trapper. Whistle blown as the puck is directed out into the crowd and a souvenir for some lucky fan tonight. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Takes that pass back at the point. Here's a shot, and that goes off a player. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Denied by the goaltender. Trying to clear, and they get it down. Yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Here they come on the attack. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. And manages to clear the zone. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Halifax gains possession shorthanded. Gets it out of his own end. Chalk that up as a win for the penalty-killing unit as the penalty expires. Both teams now back to even strength. There are times as penalty kill has looked like it's up on two wheels tonight, but they kill this last penalty off, and we go back to even strength. Halifax has it behind the net. Slides it across to OJ. Shot, and that one's turned away. Great hit on the play. Moves the puck. And now it's over to Reinhardt. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Reinhardt's moving it ahead. Horvat's going to play the puck behind the cage. And nothing doing with the goaltender there. Uh, that's really good strength by the goaltender as they quickly get over to the side of the net, right tucked up against the post to make the save. Handles the puck. Shot right in front. Stops him with the paddle. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. O'Shea's got it against the boards. From the slot, blocked in front. Shoots it, and there's the save. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. Nearing the midway mark of the period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Reinhardt's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. Now he slides it up to Reinhardt. A chance in front! Big save! Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Halifax tries to break out from their own end. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see what the official says here. 
Tripping is the call. Did he sell or is that the right one in your mind? I think it's the right one. He looks like he's picking up speed and the stick gets into his feet. Man advantage takes to the ice. It's our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. Their first power play of the night. They've worked on it. It starts with the faceoff. Win the draw. Start moving the puck quickly before you shoot it. On the attack along the boards. Quick feed to Brown. Takes a wrist shot. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. And manages to clear the zone. The Stampeders scoop it up along the boards. Passes on over to Brown. Return pass. Over the line they come. The Bulldogs take possession here in the open ice. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that puck leaves the zone. Halifax has it near the wall. Snaps one from the slot. Stones him in front. Ojay's able to get everything behind this hit. He really lays one on here. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. It's all tied up. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Gets it out of his own end. Impressive effort by the penalty killers as we are back to even strength and we are still tied. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job, keeps this game tied. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Great timing to come up with the interception. Baltimore has gained possession along the boards. Takes the cross ice pass. Referee signaling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. Let's see what the officials say. Horvath's getting two for hooking. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the play. You're a step behind. You've got to slow that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe he can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch up and got burned. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. I'm not so sure anybody's been really happy with the power play here that's been just average tonight. Some good, some really bad, and they're looking for something a little more positive on this one. is dropped and we are back underway trying to clear the zone finally Ray yeah they do get it down the ice I thought they held their structure pretty good they tried to clear the puck a couple times couldn't get it out now they're exhausted finally they can get a change and the puck's knocked loose Baltimore has got a hold of it along the wall sends a pass over here's a chance in front and makes the save and manages to clear the zone. Baltimore's got the puck along the boards. Morse gaining momentum. Sends it across. Shot comes up with the stop. Man, he's been diving and dodging all over the net all game long. He couldn't be much busier. He's been terrific as well. Here in the late goings of the period, we got a tie game and momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Penalty expires, and when you look at where things sit right now, that's a huge, huge play by the penalty killers. Uh, some disappointment on the bench after that power play. Everybody in the building knows the importance of the moment, and they weren't able to get it done. He's not had a break since that puck hit the ice about two hours ago. Every time they come into the zone, he's forced to make another stop. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. He scores! There's the hat trick, and here come the hats. Man, it is loud in here. The guy jumped up on the bench as soon as that third goal went into the net. He 
kept moving in that high slot, looking for an area that might be open. Then the puck's on and off his stick. Nice shot. Baltimore's up by one now here in this third period. They don't have much breathing room, but I guess it's better to be in front than behind. They'll want to continue to try to forecheck. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. From the left side, takes it at center. Into the corner. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Nice pass. And they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Baltimore's offense, the story tonight as they lead it here in this third period. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Makes his presence known on the ice. Misses the net. Not going to be happy with this. He's got the opportunity to score. Doesn't register a shot on goal. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Thanks to the guys in the truck, we get a great look at that hit again. He slammed him into the wall. That one hurt. The Bulldogs have been the busier team in the shot department, and they lead it late in this third period. Morris won the draw here in the offensive zone. Takes the feed. He scores! That's three, Ray! Yeah, just haven't taken their foot off the gas pedal at all here. Once they got that first one, they kept pushing away. Now they've got three. Well, that didn't work. He tried a big glove stop. Doesn't get it, but I don't think he saw much of it anyway with the traffic in front of him. Here in the dying moments of this period, Baltimore has been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. And he was slowed up. Hooking looks to be the call. The official's arm goes up in the air. Let's get the official decision. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. Sometimes you have to have the shortest of memories when you play on a specialty unit like the power play. It hasn't gone very well for them so far tonight. They have to attack this power play with a renewed vigor. The sense of urgency has really set in. They pulled the goalie, the extra attacker's out. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Under a minute to go in the third. Puts it to the front of the net, and they come up empty-handed. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Dumped into the opposite corner. The Stampeders gain possession along the wall. Carries it across the line. And that's broken up with a stick in front. That one sails to the bench, sending the coaching staff scrambling. The Bulldogs lead it late in this third period. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Looks to set up at the point now. Knocked away. Fires towards the empty net. Off target. Moves it quickly over to Horvath. Slides the puck over. Stops the rocket of a shot. And we are all over with this one. One room's feeling ecstatic after that one, but boy, how deflating is that for the other side? You just don't get many chances to come back in the series. They had their spot down 2-1, but now the winner goes up 3-1 and a commanding lead in the series. Another reason why we love playoff hockey. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Good night.